Surya sir, as the captain of the ship, I would like to come to you first. Uh, you have struck gold, you know, with casting, but that's nothing new for you. But this time round, it does look a little more special, you know, than always. So how did it all come together and what is the, you know, ingredient behind this magical casting? Uh, actually, uh, the real uh, base of this casting is a subject because it's a real subject and it is a subject uh, about uh, age group which is senior and which is climbing 17,000 feet against all odds and that also with a lot of humor, happy, faith and layered I have never had such layered characters in my film. All my films have basically been moment oriented. First time I had so many layers, so many layers that I am also, uh, I am also uh, finding as I am keeping on writing and making movies. Okay, this is also meaning of Kedaro. So when I have such characters on paper, then I had the guts to have them in real life too. Mm -hmm. So um, I have been very fortunate that I got my dream casting right from the day one. Very few rare di uh, uh, directors Super could have get it. And uh, it starts with Anupam sir, then I have Bachchan sir, then I have Bhuman sir, then Nina ji, Sareka ji, and then uh, Pariniti, and then Danny ji finally. Sabse baad mein <laughs> Danny ji hai. Oh, and you, he is very reluctant to add, you know, in that. Yeah, he, he, uh, he chose to have a nice retired life in Sikkim and to get him from there right in the middle of COVID pandemic was uh, my biggest victory, I think. No, it shows, I think, uh, the truth is out there. And I think it's now a pan-India discussion subject, this film. Yeah, really? Oh, that's Everybody amazing. Everybody talking about it. How so. wonderful. Uh, Anup, sir, I want to come to you next. You know, as somebody, you know, who has had such an illustrious acting career, and since I follow world cinema, I won't hesitate, you know, to compare your body work to, say, an Al Pacino or a Robert De Niro. Thank and you me. have done so many difficult roles, you know, starting with your first film, Sara Ansh, and then you played, you know, so many versatile characters. I just want to understand, in terms of physicality, emotional, uh, you know, challenges, where would you put this in your body of work? In my top seven films. Uh, and can you imagine that two of them are from the same production house, Saranj and uh, this film. Uh, also, there are certain characters which sort of uh, complement the person also. It changes you, your philosophy, your theory as a person also. Muchai is one such film. Parallel track of the actor in me and the person in me had both, uh, both had same goals that I want to try out my capabilities, I want to see how far can I go in… Uh, that's, that's where you find your strength. So that way it is very good and also uh, it's a story, uh, extraordinary story of ordinary people. Hmm. We are ordinary people except for Amitji's character who is a celebrated author or something like that. Both Baman and I are, I'm a shopkeeper who runs the bookstore and he has a ladies garment store, garment store. Uh, so wo common hona or unko phir, uh, for them to be able to agree to climb and then actually go through that i think needed the conviction not ne necessarily the craft there are certain films where you use a craft as an actor yes and there are certain film you use conviction uh, and the whole characterization should come across so i think this is a film uh, which is straight from the heart and straight to the screen. The craft is not used there at all. There is no voice modulation, there is nothing like them. But you have to stick to the story, stick to the truth that uh, Suraj wants us to deliver. Any special preparation, physical, uh, like because it must have been our, very daunting. We all had to fix our preparation. We also had to fix our preparation. We also had to fix the doctor. We also had to talk about the helicopter. We also had to talk about the helicopter. And bar bar unka message aata tha ki ab yahan fikr mat kariye ye ho jayega ho jayega. But uh, the only uh, thing that I suggested to him that I want to change my look means I've not been wearing wigs for uh, many films, and I try for film for his films I've never wore a wig. Uh, whether it is uh, any any film, we have never worn a wig. All the four films that I've done with him. In this I wanted to wear a wig because I thought. Otherwise, I will look the same uh, kind of a thing. It will be confused with my emotion. And the man is slightly irritable. So, that I think 
that's the only physical change I wanted to bring in and he was… Uh, <laughs> he, till he saw me in that wig, he was not very convinced. <laughs> he said, Anupam ji, I see because he thought of production problems. <laughs> he thought, I'm going to put a wig in the thang, then he'll say, I don't have a wig, I'm going to put a little bit of a wig. But uh, we had a good makeup team. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely wonderful. Baman sir, also want to come to you, you know, yes. as an actor who has been so versatile in terms of taking the idea of the character actor, especially in commercial films to the next level. You know, you are our Morgan Freeman, you know, you are our Michael Caine in that regard. But I want to understand here, you know, what was the most challenging part of this performance? Honestly, I, I don't know if it was a… The only challenge probably was getting used to the weather. Mm. <laughs> That's it. The rest just flowed. I'll tell you how it flows. It comes from there. It also comes from the act, from who you are sitting next to in the shot. You know, actors can't act in isolation. Mm. They're always feeding off each other, looking into each other's eyes and listening to what the other guy is saying. If you're not listening to the other guy, you never know how your line is going to come out. It's not so. So if his line is is coming out in a particular way. If I'm looking into his eyes and I'm listening to him, I'm already choking while I'm saying it. Mm. Because it takes me back to the days when we were acting. Acting is a bad word now, <laughs> right? It takes me back to the days when we were doing the scenes together. Mm. You just have to find truth. It's a very so stupid, cliche thing to say. But it was not a challenge. It's not because the subject is helping you. The director is there as like this beacon of kindness and and, and hope and, and positivity. The actors are all great, the highest level. All you got to do is look into their eyes, listen and react. But I have to tell you this also, that uh, uh, as a director, there have been incidents where we have a 9 to 6 shift in a day and we have to do the rest of the day. Because you have such talent, I have to only write a scene, 3, 3, 4, 4 pages ka scene. Has it happened in one take? Wow. Because I have, and I put three cameras, my job is only to keep camera play around here. Ask them once, twice, thrice and it goes in one take. So and that is… Wow. And very few times, <laughs> actors used to get irritated. Sade gyaara maje pack up kar diya yaar. Aur scene karo. Hamari jo creative head hai, Surbhi. Mein usko puchta, Surbhi, kya kar rahe hai? Sade gyaara maje kyun? He used to say, mujhe nahi karna aur scene. He used to get upset. Why are you telling me to do the second scene? He used to get upset because yes, we have to go home. No, <laughs> sir. I have, I have work to do. Matlab, it is not a joke. This cast, ke saamne any director, whatever age, if he is not prepared, all of them can catch a director. All First day, you ask, uh, sir, first day, you tell me, sir, first day, you go to the set, पहला कैमरा से आपको मालूम है क्या बनने वाली है सर एम आई राइट बिल्कुल सो सर उसके सामने मेरे को प्रिपेयर करने के लिए आधा दिन तो चाहिए तो दैट इज माय सीक्रेट ऑफ 11:30 कमाल है 11:30 में हां एक दो बार तो 11:30 बजे क्या कितने क्या कितने बजे की शिफ्ट है 9 टू 6 है जी 9 टू 6 सीन हां बड़ा लंबा सीन है 11:00 बजे खत्म हो गया तो अब क्या करें दूसरा सीन करें नहीं नहीं निकल करते हैं सो आई थिंक <laughs> that that was yeah that was the also the yeah. comfort as a co-actor I must say to be working with such amazing actors yes. mm -hmm. because there was no question there and also there was no sometime on the set we actors have a habit of sort of intellectualizing uh, role according to me acting is about delivering yes. if you deliver what you think is not important what you deliver is important or yahan ye baat bahut achhi inhone boli yahan faith tha ki हमारे वो फेथ एक्सरसाइज कराते हैं कि आप आंख पे आंख पे पट्टी बांध के आपको कहीं भी गिरा देते और आपको पकड़ पकड़ेगा पकड़ेगा ये होता तो वो दैट इज द फेथ थिएटर में वो एक्सरसाइज कराते हैं यहां वो प्रॉब्लम ही नहीं थी यू न्यू दैट यू विल यू विल थ्रो द बॉल एंड द सामने वाला आपको संभालेगा I think trust is very important and that is why I also want to understand what kind of off-camera conversations you had you know while working on especially in those extreme conditions when those were the best moments in the whole film. It was like, it literally was out of, uh, like a movie in itself. Yeah. Like mm. two friends with a back to the camera, mm. the sunset, the, the mountains smoking. You know, when the, when the snow flies over the mountain, it looks like there's smoke coming out of the mountain. Mm. And we are sitting and you can hear uh, our thoughts and our minds and our 
अपने जो अरमान होते हैं अपने जो फ्यूचर के बारे में सोचते हैं द मोस्ट ब्यूटीफुल मोमेंट्स दैट आई शेयर ऑन दिस फिल्म विद और हम खेलते थे काफ़ी हम अंताक्षरी खेलते थे वर्ड बिल्डिंग खेलते थे हम डम शार्ट्स खेलते थे आप कहते हैं हाउ विल यू सम फीलिंग वी वर हैप्पी बींग पार्ट ऑफ दिस फिल्म इन बींग इन मोस्ट डिफिकल्ट सिचुएशन ठंडा पानी आ रहा है कोई किसी को नहीं पर कंप्लेन कर रहा वरना तो ए सी ठीक नहीं चल रहा ये नहीं चल रहा तो होटल में फट फोन हो जाता है मगर नहीं है मैं कहूँ कि फाइव स्टार ट्रीटमेंट फाइव स्टार होटल में अगर रहते और हम अगर हम खुश नहीं है तो चाय के अंदर की चूनी चीनी भी मतलब उसमें गड़बड़ लगती है उसमें बड़ा क्या है लॉग कैबिन लिटरली एंड बेदिंग इन दैट कोल्ड वाटर सुबह में बट वी आर हैप्पी डूइंग दैट बिकॉज वी नो दैट पीपल आर लाफिंग बाकी बाजू के रूम में बाजू के रूम में से हजरा बमन ना आ रहा है चल रहा है It's so beautiful. Otherwise, you st- can complain about five, seven star luxury if um, you feel, you know. You know, this Bomsi is. Re- sorry, ha, Bomsi, you remember Manang? Me, we were shooting in Manang. It was 13,000 feet, and a landslide came. So, here, the land, here, the mountain has fallen. There, the mountain has fallen. And we are inside. We are shooting. There is no car. There is no car. So, I have taken Bomsi and Anupam sir. They have taken a lot of pictures. I don't know how much it is falling. तो इतना कुत्ते कुत्ते गए तो अनुपम सर बोलते हैं कि बहुत मजा आया मैं तीन किताबें एक साथ पढ़ सकता था इतना खतरनाक रास्ता था जॉब ऑफ अ प्रोड्यूसर इज वेरी कॉम्प्लेक्स एंड यू नो सिंस यू आर ऑल्सो मेकिंग अ फोर इन टू दिस न्यू एवेन्यू आई जस्ट वॉन्ट टू अंडरस्टैंड यूर एसोसिएशन विद द प्रोजेक्ट एंड वॉट वॉज द एंटायर एक्सपीरियंस लाइक Yeah so I consider myself very lucky that you know this is the first project that I'm doing in terms of uh, a Bollywood feature film and um, I get to work with this sort of veteran director this sort of veteran cast who you know I mean clearly I don't even need to say this they love what they do they have this passion they have this conviction they're looking to embrace challenges right and that's sort of a dream as a producer you know you want to find a story that you think will connect with all generations you want to find people that really want to bring that story to life right that is the job of a producer how do you put how do you match the story to the people and then bring it to life right in a certain time frame and budget obviously absolutely and i think that you know what is really special about this film is and i think this is actually a good message to our whole generation or a younger generation watching this film is that life will always have challenges right mm. there'll always be ups and downs there'll always be uchais mountains to climb but you have to enjoy the journey i think as a younger generation now we're so spoiled we're so used to convenience we're so used to getting you know things in a certain time frame that we've actually lost that ability to form deep connections as we struggle you know and i think that is the beauty of supporting a film like this i think it really will connect with people from all over the country because you know everyone in this film has their own personal challenges mm. but they manage to they manage to overcome their challenges not just for themselves but for someone else wow. so you know that's the beauty of the struggle that how can you build a community you know while you're going through something yeah. and one look then they have question. done that i want last question and that is for each and every one of you i want to understand how important it is to keep the big screen moving alive you know mm-hmm. and what are the challenges mm-hmm. that we are facing now i i, I feel i'm sorry i'm going with first mm-hmm. on that's it that's why i looked at you uh, uh, i looked uh, at your seniors when mm-hmm. you <laughs> <laughs> i think think of the big screen experiences we've had when we were younger for example just now we went and saw mr bachan's festival we saw marak barantani to together and people are enjoying it together i think cinema unites us as a people as a country as a race um because when movies of goodness come you all we all together are feeling you know we we feeling good about ourselves right i find it sometimes difficult to to not have a, a collective laugh or a collective emotion because when everybody laughs when the that sound is a sound you can't even imagine mm-hmm. so when everybody laughs together you say yeah i'm part of something it's like being in a cricket match watching it at home and maybe in the state 
I feel that collectiveness also. Sometimes, you know, people are you shooting it on, on a big format. 7.1, 80.1, I don't know those sound mm. systems. Mm -hmm. What are we doing all that for? True, true. Because so it, true. it makes the cinema going experience, not for it to be a special effects job, mm. but to also watch those faces on screen, their nerves, their eyes reddening, the capillaries in their eyes, you can <coughs> see the tear breaking, mm. breaking and forming. You can't, it's different. And I think that watching that collectively, I think unites us. And I feel that the most beautiful experience of my life, my childhood is to watch, sitting in the dark, mm. watching movies. That's been my childhood. Wow. Mm. Anupam ah. sir, would you like to add something? I think it's he brilliantly described. I think it's like watching Niagara Falls uh, on your TV. <laughs> it's like watching Taj Mahal <coughs> or, or, or Eiffel Tower on TV. But I, I said it earlier also, uh, this film, this film, uh, this film uh, is our answer to, uh, mm -hmm. to Hollywood makes, uh, for them to get into the audience, they are making now these larger than life Marvel films and superheroes films. The superheroes of this film are 65 plus mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and normal, they have leg aches, they have this thing and yet they reach the destination they have decided to do. And this can only be enjoyed in a cinema hall. Mm. And he's right, when you sit in the darkness, there is only the connection is between actor and you. Mm. pause karte hai, khana lagao, yari da, do da, da, de karo. Aur hum apni zindagi ka best expression de rahe <laughs> You know? Aur wo bada, bada, aray ruko na ya, tumme, mm -hmm. maya, tumme bhi da, dubara karo, rewind karo. Matlab, uh, we are changing with times, but I think uh, the courage and what conviction that Suraj has shown in making this film and they will bring uh, the audiences in the Absolutely. theater mm. and they, they have to see it. If your thought is small, then you can see this film on the small side. If your thought is big, then this film will see you on the big side. I think this is the perfect way to you know bring this interview to an end. Right. And I really look forward to the film and all the best. And so do we. We yes. also look forward to it. <laughs> yes. And pleasure talking to you. Pleasure talking to you. It's my pleasure. Very, very lovely chatting.